Hey guys! What's up? Alpha Y and Simba here, and welcome to another creature comparison. I've talked about prehistoric creatures many times on this segment, but now it's time for me to talk about a comparison between two marine prehistoric creatures. I'm doing Liopleurodon, or smooth-sided tooth, versus Mosasaurus, or Muse River Lizard. So, let's take a dive into the prehistoric sea. As always, we start with our similarities. First up, both Liopleurodon and Mosasaurus were large aquatic predators that lived during the Mesozoic era. And they hunted many of the same types of prey. They hunted small fish, sharks, ammonites, and other aquatic reptiles such as ichthyosaurs or turtles. Now then, let's talk about the differences. First up is their time periods. Liopleurodon lived 208 to 145 million years ago during the Jurassic period. Mosasaurus, on the other fin, lived 85 to 65 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. They also lived in different parts of the world. Liopleurodon fossils have been found in northern Europe. By contrast, Mosasaurus fossils have been found worldwide. Liopleurodon, for its gigantic size, was also smaller than Mosasaurus. The average length for a Liopleurodon was an estimated 16 to 23 feet, and it only weighed 1 to 2 tons in total. By contrast, according to our fossil records, Mosasaurus grew to be 35 to 55 feet long and weighed an average of 20 to 23 tons. Additionally, Mosasaurus also had another set of teeth on the roof of its mouth, which were meant to slice pieces of meat into smaller pieces so that they can be swallowed, much like a modern-day moray eel, a trait that was not found in Liopleurodon. Well, that was it. My creature comparison on Liopleurodon and Mosasaurus. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave requests in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Now, let's go back to the safari hat and see what our next creature comparison is going to be, shall we? All right, let's see. Here we go. Well, for the next one, we're definitely going to the dogs, and these are going to be two really tough dogs. Alpha Y and Simba, out.